actually don't really know what's in this box um, because this is a box that was sent to me by Top Archery Wild Store. It's a seller on AliExpress who have asked me to do some videos with this bow. I think it's a wrapped bow. Um, that's a short bow. Kind of a... If from the picture they sent me, I think it's a wrapped ottoman. But um, the box is a lot longer than I anticipated it, so we're about to find out what's actually inside here, since I actually don't 100% know. Um, all the links will be below and connected. So let's see what is actually in your side, because I don't know. I'm kind of curious. I was itching to open it when the postie stopped off so I could see what it is. But I saved it until this evening so you could see what I was opening. And it is what they said it was. The picture said it was. It's not really a Turkish, but it is a wrapped bow. Um, it has the... Okay, let's finish taking the... Finish taking this off. Okay. String. Yeah, it's a top archery product. It's got the top archery label on it, nicely put on the on the wood sea. It's as you can see. It's, not a very dramatic sea. It does have kind of a the same kind of handle grip bulb that you would find on a Turkish, only it's quite large. It's not very small. It is a wrap bow with snakeskin and you know. Uh, no mention of draw weight, so I have no idea what the draw weight is. So Let's see. What this string's like. Maybe there's some writing here. Nope, no writing. Other than top archery. Now, let's see what that brace height is. That's I did give it a tiny little bit of twist. 7 inch brace height automatic right off the hop. Oh, that's got some weight to it. Uh, interesting. It's got a bit of it's leather wrapped and a little bit of different skin for your arrow pass. Here we go. Let's put a knock point on. I usually just use a brass knocking point. Uh, that's 28. It gets up to 28 comfortably. Uh, I don't think it's going to go much further than that though. So, that's 26, the black one's 28, and the second white, the yellow one is uh, 31. Gets up to 28. And a little bit beyond that. As we work it in. Wrap fiberless bulb with the wood seas. So I'm going to take it to 28. Zero that out. See what kind of weight this is.
35 pounds. So, 35 pounds. That's a lot of couple of arrows loose. Got to wax the string. remember correctly, when uh, they sent me the link to this, to show me what they were thinking of sending me, at the time it was $52 Canadian plus another $40 in freight. So, let's say $90 Canadian. I'll post the links below so that'll take you to the most recent and you'll see what the current pricing is since I don't know. You know guys, this is not um, I'm going to check the, I'm going to see what this is like on the paper tune with these particular arrows. These are, what are these? These are Heritage Carbon Express Heritage 150s, uncut. Uh, they are 498 grain or something like that. And they're landing straight over there. I'm kind of curious to see what they look like through the paper. You know, this is like an opening and first impression. I wasn't 100% sure what was in there. And if I was using the box as a reference, of, oh, there goes all nine arrows have let, been let loose. Um, I'm going to start some experimenting with it. Uh, it is 35, this particular one that they sent me was 35 pounds at... 28. Uh, once I kind of get, I'll figure out. I'll figure out from there roughly what I'm drawing, uh, and then I'll measure that weight. Though it, I, it was, I was fighting to get past that 28. The the, the grip's a little big, but it's also not uncomfortable. Um, this bow, you know, it's in the hundred dollar range with freight kind of thing, depending on where you are. I'm not sure. You know, for a wrap bow, oh, how about we do something important? Very important. How long is it? Now, this will be strong. Just to make my life easy, I'm going to go tip to tip. Actually, I'll do tip to tip and then I'll do knock to knock. Wow. This is a um, tip to tip, only 45 inches strong. 7 inch brace height, I still don't know if that's right or not, but, and then 43 and a half knock to knock. That's, that's impressive. That's actually very impressive, guys. Very impressive. Okay. Keep having fun. Um... I'm going to make some time to do some more testing and some more experimenting with this one and it can join my experiments. I've got three, this will be three experiments on the go right now since um, those other bows showed up that are also part of my experiment to shoot every day. So I'll be rotating through different bows to shoot every day for the next little while to see what they're like. Thanks again to the, the, the Top Archery Wild Store. Um, for sending this to me. I, I will be sending them a link and other connections. I have purchased a number of bows from them and I have created a playlist, which is probably why they asked me to make this video because I've been making videos anyways uh, of the bows that I have purchased from them. Uh, so I have several bows that are, are from Top Archery and I've been happy with all of them so far. Um, my first impression of this one is quite good. So keep having fun guys.